Okay, today I'm going to show you how to download, unzip, and upload a SVG from lovesvg.com. Now, this is the way you would download it from anywhere else. You would just download the file and then unzip it like I'll show you. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose a SVG. You can go to the free SVG cut files. There are 229 pages of them. I'm just going to pick one here, click on it, it tells you that you're going to get four different files. The one you really want is the SVG, so you can delete the other ones if you want to, if you're not going to use it in any of these other programs. So don't ever click on this. This is clickbait. This is an ad. This is what you need right here. So this is the one we're going to use. If you want the commercial license, you can press that and it'll give you the option to buy the license. What you can do is just download the zip file. I choose this little arrow here and I always save as. I save it to my desktop. Choose my desktop. And you press save. You can open it straight from there or you can find it on your desktop. Here is what the file will look like. I'm going to right click on it. I'm going to go to extract all. Because I have WinZip Universal on my Windows 10, if you don't have that, you'll have to download WinZip. So what you just what you do is you push right click on your mouse and you press extract all. I always extract it to my desktop so you can choose wherever you want in the file system here and then extract and there it is and you can click on it and here are all the files so what you do is you just choose all of them except the SVG I normally delete them so they don't take up space then I take it out of that file you can delete the main zip file and this is all you need so after that what you do is you go to Cricut Design Space you click on upload you go to upload image and then you can just drag that right in there and then you can label it whatever you want and you press save and you add it to your pro insert it to your project And here are all the layers. Now what I normally do is I try to get the like colors together so you can ungroup it and then you can either pull each piece away or you can choose choose the colors there like this is the word patch. You can weld it together. It won't hurt it because it's all the same color you can choose this next one which are these two green ones you can weld those two together and they'll stay and see we got this pumpkin word here you can also weld that and then if you would like to get these two green ones and this black one together you can do that otherwise it will look like this and you'll have to move this little pumpkin around which you can serve more vinyl this way or you can pull these away and weld those together and then you can put that back put your pumpkin back and you can pull this away. You'll have to ungroup this one here. You can pull this little guy out. Choose these two. Weld it. Then you'll have to put all this back into place. up properly and then 
and then we'll have to pull the rest of it out and weld these two together and then it will then you just kind of have to put them together it's a little bit easier but you waste some vinyl okay so that's all you have to do to extract upload download SVGs if you have any questions please let me know again this is Windows 10 I also have a video on how to do this on the MacBook thank you